In this video, I'm going to talk about how to build a major scale. So a major scale is usually a set of musical notes um, that center around a fundamental frequency. So if it's C major, then the notes are going to center around C being the home key. Okay, so how do we write out a scale? A major scale has this pattern. Um, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and C. So there's it's a seven note scale and we indicate the scale degrees with kind of a little carrot thing. So scale degree number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then back to one. And so the pattern for all major scales is this. For your scale degree number one to two, you have a whole step. What is a whole step? A whole step is characterized by two semitones apart. So it's two notes that are two, two semitones apart. Um, you can think of it as a distance of, you know, where you have a note in between. Whereas a half step would be the smallest step on the scale. Like from here to here, that's a half step. Here to here is a half step. Here to here is a half step. Here to here would be a whole step. Here to here would be a whole step. Whole step step, half step. Okay, so scale de degree one to two is going to be a whole step apart. From scale degree two to three is a whole step apart. Scale degree three to four is going to be a half step. E to F right here is a half step. F to G is a whole step. G to A is a whole step. A to B is a whole step. B to C, the seven to one, is a half step. So that's how you build a major scale. Let's try it in a different key instead of C major. Um, let's do let's do A major. So we have A, so A, B. I'm just gonna write out the notes. So you wanna do it space line, space line, space. So it's a step apart. So all scales, you only can have one of each note. You can't skip around. You can't have like a F and an F sharp. Um, or a G and a G sharp. You only can have one of each letter. So here's scale degree number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one. So here, A to B, is that a whole step? Yes, that's a whole step. How about B to C? Now on the piano, B to C is a half step. So what do we need to do? We need to raise that C to a C sharp. Now we have a whole step. And then C sharp to D, is that a half step? Correct, that's a half step. Uh, D to E, that should be a whole step. E to F, E to F on the piano is a half step. So what do we need to do? We need to raise that pitch. So now this is a whole step. F sharp to G is a half step, so we actually need to raise that so it's a whole step. And then here we go, G sharp to A, we have a half step. So our pattern, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. So that is our major scale pattern and we can do it with any, any key. Um, let's do F sharp major. Okay, so I'm just gonna do the same thing, just building up the scale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, then back to one. So I know from here to here, I need a whole step. F sharp to G is a half step. We need to raise it so it's a whole step. From here to here, we need another whole step. So G sharp to A, that's actually a half step. So I need to sharp this note. Um, a sharp to B is a half step, so that's good. Um, B to C is a half step, and I need that to be a whole step. So I need to raise that up. Um, C sharp to D is a half step. I need to make sure it's a whole step, so I'm gonna raise that. Um, D sharp to E is a half step. I need that to be a whole step. So I'm going to sharpen that whole step. And then E sharp to F sharp, we got a half step. So there you go. F sharp major. Let's play it on the piano. Okay, so from here to here, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. So that's how you build a major scale, starting with any note. Pick any note, write it out, you know, one step at a time, and then make sure you follow this pattern of whole steps and half steps 
Um, and then that's how you get a major scale.